Hello, welcome to Living with Liz 4. I'm Liz. Today we're going to be doing a cash stuffing of my paycheck. Um, it's been probably a month since I've recorded anything at all. Um, I ended up using all of my sinking funds and all of the money that I had in all of my savings areas. But I knew that was going to happen with having my surgery. That's what the money was saved for. So we are starting fresh. So I won't be saving anything in this video. This is just going to be my cash stuffing and stuffing of my daily binder. Um, and let's just go ahead and get started. So I should have $900 in hundreds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine hundred. And I should have 520s. Two, four, six, eight. One, two, four, six, eight. Two, two, four, six, eight. Three, two, four, six, eight. Four, two, four, six, eight. Five. All right, so the bank got it right. And of course, in my book, let's see. All right, first we're gonna start off with rent. And we are not paying bi-weekly anymore, we are paying monthly, which is $700, lot 31. <clears throat> and that's gonna be seven $100 bills. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, let's highlight that. Let's see, next is going to be Annabelle. Now, I didn't pay Annabelle for the month of May because I didn't have any income. So, I owe her $200, one and $200. Oh, no, I'm giving her $200 in 20s. Two, four, six, eight, one, two, four, six, eight, two. Count that one more time. Two, four, six, eight, one, two, four, six, eight, two. All right. Now she won't be getting paid for the summer just because um, my father is taking my younger two children for the whole summer. Um, I've never had them be gone for a whole summer. Generally, the longest time I've ever spent away from them is four days. Um, and that was when I had my surgery and I was ready to see them after two. So we will see how well this taking them for the whole summer is going to work out. Um, but now that's done. We can highlight it. Alright, and then last but not least is my favorite part. My daily binder. I'll just stick this back in here. All right, and our mini binder or our daily binder gets 180, 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 80. Should be right. Two, four, six, eight, one, two, four, six, eight. Okay, so how are we going to do this? So we're going to do household 20, gas is separate, water gets 40, day and night gets 40, pets get 20. Best food gets 20, and that leaves an extra 20 for household. See, I haven't done this in a month, and I forgot how much I put in each one. So $40 is going in household. This is for laundry detergent, trash bags, cleaning supplies um, that I might need. Gas, I might as well just go in line. Gas, this time, is getting $140. 20, 40, 60, 80, 120, huh, I can't do that, so 1, 20, 140, <clears throat> and I do need to get gas, I'm on like 50 miles to empty, but every time it get like every time it gets down to like 50 miles or below, my check engine light comes on, but then I put gas in it and it goes away, so, I don't know, I don't know anything about vehicles, so I don't know what's going on with it. But as long as the check engine light does not stay on, I'm fine with it. Let me just highlight that real quick. Shows that I paid it. Mini, I paid. Let's see. Gonna keep going. Water bill, I gotta pay that. Uh, 
oops see now look at this they, they're coming off again i'm gonna have to make some more and i've been putting off getting on my cricket for a little while because i need to make um two graduation binders one for me and one for my friend amanda for her son walker date night gets forty dollars and I'll probably spend the $40 because next week we're going to Soaky Mountain in Tennessee. It's a water park. And on the 7th and 8th of June, if you have um, an A or a passes on your report card and you're a child, you get to go into Soaky Mountain for free. And this year, all three of my children have report cards and they passed. All three of them passed. So they get to go in for free and I just have to pay for me. So it's a super cheap day, but they get to have fun. So that's what we're doing next weekend. Fast food gets $40. Of course, this is never enough. I always end up <clears throat> spending more. I take it out of my personal money. All right, and last but not least is personal, and that's getting $180. That should be the rest of my cash. $1, $20, $40, $60, $80. And then we're supposed to get another kitten. And I was thinking it's going to be like a hundred bucks to get him spayed and all that stuff. But it turns out it's actually going to be $300, which is a lot more than I thought it was going to be. I don't even know if I have it in the budget. Uh, for the next time I get paid. <coughs> Sorry about that. But look at that. I love my daily minder. There we go. We'll just put it like that. So this is done. Coming over here. Let's see. There, it's personal. So all we have left is food, which goes on the credit card. The car payment, which goes on the credit card. And my insurance, which goes on the credit card. And then next week, Annabelle is going to Dollywood. And I'm a chaperone. And then I'm supposed to get a girl's, like, um, an electric vehicle or electric car. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to get that anymore or not. Um, but yeah, that's all that's been going on with me. Besides that, everything's been good. I've had two shows, but I ended up having to spend the money on bills. Um, all my bills are caught up with, so they are current. None of them are behind or anything like that, <clears throat> which is always a good thing. Um, so yeah, I'll probably be doing another video tomorrow because I have a show tomorrow in Cherokee. Um, and hopefully I sell some cups because I have like five cases of cups. So like 125 cups or something like that. Just sitting in the back of my car. Um, and then I don't have another show for the month of June. As of right now, I don't have one. I'm trying to get something lined up, but, you know, having surgery just kind of put a hold on everything. Oh, wait, can't forget this. For our game of loans, we have to do three and a third. And I'm, I think I'm a little bit behind on this because I haven't done it this month. Um, But I'm going to go through and do my math and see where I'm at, like how many I should have done. And then I'll fix that off camera. So we're just going to go ahead and do three and a third for this car payment. Look at that. We are getting closer and closer to being done and paid off with this car. I can't wait. Cannot wait for my car to be paid off. My cell phone's going to be paid off this year. My credit cards are going to be paid off this year. I'm just very excited for the rest of this year to come along. And then for Grace's birthday, which is the next birthday that we have, I decided to surprise her and we're going to go in July and we're going to go to SeaWorld and Aquatica. Now we were going to go to Universal Studios, but they upped their prices for their parks so that they're more expensive. Um, and we've never been to SeaWorld and we've never been to Aquatica, which is SeaWorld's water park. 
So we're going to go and spend four days over there for her birthday. And then, of course, I still have the cruise in September with Annabelle for her birthday. And then this year will be the last year that I spend so much money on their birthdays. Because Genevieve's birthday, I spent 1500 Grace's birthday, I'm spending 2000 Annabelle's birthday, I'm probably spending close to four grand, <clears throat> Which is a lot for birthdays. But, I mean, they only turn that age one time. And I wanted them to have good memories of this year. I really did. This year was all about us having fun. And saving money. But having fun. And I've accomplished so much this year already. I just, I'm really looking forward to seeing how the rest of this year is going to pan out. So that's all I have for today. I will talk to you tomorrow. I hope you have a wonderful and blessed day. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment.